Hello there and welcome back to another episode in our modded series. Now, in today's one, I believe we should be pretty much able to complete everything that we do want to construct in the in this district here. Now, what I've done off camera here is okay. So this road here, which has if I go this way with the mouse wheel, uh, I've dynamited all the way through and we've got platforms on top now as well. So that means half this area is now nice and fertile. We still have to extend this in the future, but I think for now, that's pretty good already. That's um, looking nice and green. We can start putting down some trees as well. How far can you reach, by the way? Not too far. Okay, well, that's a bit of a shame, but okay. We'll look at one section at a time. Right, so up here we were sort of mirroring both sides, so they look the same. However, with the buildings, uh, let's go back to the top actually. With the buildings, it's just going to be uh, very random. I don't want to keep any order in this, how these living, uh, the, the, the houses for the beavers are going to be laid out. It, it's just the gardens where we've had some uh, city planning beavers rock up and um, yeah, follow plans essentially. All right, are you still planting up there? Yes, you are. Wonderful. Now, down here, what I'd like to do, because we do have some solid ground, uh, I'd like to have, or give us a, a temple. Now, which way should the beavers go? I think maybe we'll do it this way. Yep, that seems pretty reasonable. And I do want this to be somewhat hidden as well. So we will 100% have some trees just around and we'll let them go wild later. But for now, it's just going to be blunted like so. Okay, uh, we've got 8.4 days left till the drought will... Actually, let's speed up the time because it is evening time once again. It seems the beavers are now also using those little shrines in here, which is wonderful. Is anyone going to sit on those benches as well? Not really. Maybe during daytime. Okay. Right. Yeah. How many more hours? Just a little bit. What was the next thing we wanted to look at? Oh, yeah. We've got a little farm or wheat farm station going in here. Uh, all there is. What I quite like about this is it, it feels somewhat realistic. That uh, we have those fences in here. A couple of trees growing on the sides as well. Maybe we should add a few more. In the, in the future, maybe in these corners there. And then what happens is this road comes into the farm, but it just doesn't stop here. It keeps going for a little while, cuts into the wheat fields, and then stops or disappears over there. There is a bit of a set of wooden stairs there, but um, yeah, it uh, feels pretty peaceful and lovely in here. In here, we probably want to have a couple more trees, so why don't we... Add a few, just like so. That should be fine. And maybe another pinch there as well, just so beavers can relax when they when they get tired. Now that's a bit messy in here. Don't think we. Oh, wait a second. Yeah, that's awkward. Okay, but I think we're fine because these trees can now spread into this corner here. Yeah, that should be fine. All right. And what I'd also like to do is, we do... Oh, it's pretty laggy, yeah. There we go. Couple of these trees, and a few birches right about there as well. Okay. Are you gonna be fine? Really hope it's gonna be fine. There we go. Now, what we have to decide is, which road shall they use? I think this one might be a bit more straight. Especially if they have to go up there. We should and we shall probably keep this one here. Okay, let's take you out. Which way were you going? Okay, that's fine. And in here as well, let's make it just a little bit prettier. By doing this. Yeah, that's uh, happy days. Okay, cool. Now, moving on, that's all green. I am going to relocate and move those farms around a little bit. And then we'll figure out how we want to decorate this area here as well. This reminds me. Are we not going to cut down this farming space a little bit? I think we were. Anyways. Yep. 
let's do that. Now, looking at the pyramid, we have some funky things happening in uh, in here. Uh, right, so this uh, set of stairs is done. Why are you not able to construct things? Oh, is it really that we have no range anymore? Oh, it might be. Yep, I think that's exactly what is happening right now. We'll try and put a few more levees in place. Let's see what happens. Check it on that side as well. Yep, they're pretty much done. Okay, and it seems we've run out of water. So how about let some water go through and same in here. Just all of you. Yeah, we still got a few pumps in here. 700 water should last us a few more days. Yep. Well, we'll see what happens. If it's uh, a bit too crazy, is it going to flood already just yet? No. Nope. Maybe. Yep. We'll increase you back to one and uh, let it slowly trickle through if it will. I think it has already. Yep. That looks very green in here. All right. So those beavers seem to be going up. Yeah. Oh, dear. They're going to get stuck, aren't they? Ah, uh, nightmare. Okay, there we go. Maybe they'll uh, get a few of those sections done. I think it's probably time we have to uh, I'll put down one of those extra district centers somewhere there as well. Another thing that I'd like to see what they will and shall look like are those sunflowers. So why don't we fill up this... Oh, never mind. They have no no reach over there, so how about we stick you there instead? And now what we were planning to do right about here, maybe we change it back to folk tales, was that there's gonna be a bit of fencing just around the farm perimeter. Uh, there's a few more potatoes there in our way, but it's alright, we'll wait a little bit. What's gonna happen is uh, we... If the beavers had some sort of bicycles or even cars one day, who knows? They could drive into this farm through the fields, maybe even have... Oh yeah, now I do remember. Uh, we wanted these areas to be clear, and what we wanted to do was have fences. Maybe from here. Well, anyways, let's do it through here. Right, and what's gonna... Getting a little distracted here. I don't think that's where we want them, but I don't know. Okay, yeah, we're driving in. We'll have a couple of farms here, a few trees as well. Maybe even a, a nice area with a few benches and what else can we build? And then those farms will reach all the way, I guess, inside here as well. Maybe this is not going to be the entrance for them. What I'd like to actually do is move this district center back to there. But the range we're going to lose means we will not be able to... <laughs> if we do it like so, let's see. Okay, it can go all the way up there right we disconnect you from the other district center check this out now oh okay this is not bad at all right right anyways getting a little side uh, sidetracked how is our oh temple is almost done these trees should be in any second as well so okay so that's fantastic now we finally have access to temple again because this one is a little bit out of reach. Now we've... Ooh, wait, 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 wait. I think we have problems in this area. Right, let's put some water back in there. And how about we take a look at you as well. Put you at zero. That should be fine. How are those walls going, guys? Oh, you don't have... You're missing the last set of stairs. Okay, highest priority... And then get to filling this area in. Right, there's our tower. Well, it's not there yet. Soon to be tower. It's quite far out there. But, you know what? We put so many metal blocks in here. I'm not gonna move it back. It is what it is. So, let's leave it, leave it as it is. What else do we have here? This is just normal. Are you starting to flood this area already? I really hope you are. That's looking nice and clean as well. And everything else was done in here. Yep, I haven't really done anything. Okay, so what we can probably do is, just as a quick measure, do we have 100 dynamites? 300 in total. Okay, so we are starting to catch up again with our production, and that's good. That is very good. 
All right, another thing we shall do in here is take out this road. And let's just fill as many dynamites as we can. If we can't do all of them, that's okay. I don't think we can. No. Yep, that's fine. Bring up the water again and take a look at all this. If we go back to decorations, couple of benches here so that our beavers that are either lazy or very tired can have a quick rest. Then what we shall also do, let's put these trees. No, let's not do those ones. Maybe something like this. Yep. Beautiful. Happy days. Now, I don't think we're going to do the same thing on the other side. Now that I think about it, this should have been the carousel, actually. Because the power could have connected very nicely. Actually, never mind what we said in the last episode was that the carousel is going to be connected. Ooh, how far can we do it? Do we want to block this area? That's kind of like where they might be crossing in the future. Although, it would be kind of cool if it goes, yep, all the way here. Hmm. I'm starting to like this idea. Only problem that I can think of is most likely their range again. Uh, and the distance they have to run, so if they are... Yep, I do see it. It would have been smarter if the carousel was here. Very close by, I mean, for the beavers that are going to live in these buildings, that's too, not too bad. But it just kind of looks cool on this corner. Yep, we are going to do it. Now, since this is the main road, maybe it will be better. No, not sure. We are going to put the carousel here. Maybe I'll just pause it so we don't waste any metal. But with the rest, I believe we can take those trees out a couple of these might start to spread but that's actually really good that's exactly what we want to see and what we shall do i think we are looking to close it in right about there all right and there we go a few trees around this place as well that's gonna make it much more nicer uh, beautiful so that means we still have this massive block in here where we have not really scheduled much in just yet. Uh, wait a second, I'd like to probably pause this section here, just in case we need to build another... Yeah, doesn't look like he's going to be able to hmm, plant everything in that area. But this sign seems to be pretty good. Now, since we don't have farmers in here, I think these carrots can go... They are no longer needed. Happy days. Uh, wait a second. Did we waste some water? 5.8 days, actually. Even if we did, I think it's fine. We can um, bring you back to like 3.5 and you were 4. 4.5 is fine as well. What about you guys? 2.5? Yep, that's okay. Now, <laughs> I will leave this carousel boss just in case we all decide, yep, it's going to be better to place it here and relocate this little section of a village all of it right about there. I mean, it's say our production zone is going to be here anyway, so maybe it is smarter to have it nice and close, but it just, it just feels like it fits perfectly in here. Yep. Now, oh, this reminds me, we don't really have any paper here, do we? I don't think we have. Right. Uh, checking the range again. We can do... What are you holding? Nothing. Ah, they're probably still bringing resources in, right? Yep. Alright, anyways. Food-wise, I think we're good. We got lots of potatoes. Heaps of carrots coming in as well. So, yeah. And now we finally have some sunflowers. Okay. I really want to place farms and defenses in here so that they will not be, you know, chopping them down. Because that would be really sad. Now, to make the rest of this area fertile, uh, I don't think we're going to place anything here. So, how about... I believe this section can already go as well. Yep, let's put some of them over there. Beautiful. And we really need a forest there in here as well. Okay, I think this will do, at least for the time being. 
get some of these uh, trees and things planted and we'll be we'll be happy because it looks nice and nice and green this reminds me we can do I don't think we're gonna have a road through noticed well no, in the past few episodes when uh, episodes when we are trying to put those trees down it just really lags everything out when we are choosing which trees to plant maybe it's oh, let's just pause it just in case Maybe we'll unmark a few of those cutting areas. Hopefully that's going to help us uh, maybe a little bit. How are we doing here? Well, no one's really cutting down anything right about now. So yeah, you can you can go as well. There's nothing there. And that's the last cutting area, right? Well, except that one. Okay, that's all minimized as much as we can realistically. Speaking, of course, yeah. And now they are doing the dynamites. You are gonna need access, so get up there, get that one done. Leisure wise, okay, we can do another road. Uh, we'll let those trees block this area because we don't really want to construct anything else in there, so that is all good as well. And I'll mirror. Oh, that's what I could have done, probably. If we break a hole, let's say somewhere there. Can you now? Yes. Perfect. Okay. Off you go. Well, everyone's on the break right now, so we'll leave them be. However, let's just have a quick look. What else do we have for leisure? New campfires. Well, that's already enough. We don't need them. Littles, we've got two here as well. Temple, there is one. Yep, it's not even that full, to be honest. Carousel, already scheduled in. Now, mud bath. I should really look up if they can be put in water. Doesn't really say anything. Okay, maybe another garden and lots of trees around. What would be more smart though is because there is this road got him hmm, going through here. It might be more beneficial if we let this road carry on. And not to the carousel here. Yep, this might make a little bit more sense. And maybe something like that looks pretty... Yeah, and trees can be around. It doesn't have to be one level away. It already has fences. And actually, that fits quite um, quite well over here. Alright, let's keep it sped up a little bit. Now, power-wise, how are we going to pull this in? We do have this rose in here, but that's one level higher. And bringing that through, it would be nice if we actually did bring a road through. It seems to be this one here, which connects would connect up with this village in there. We do have the power wires right about there. What happens if we were to connect them straight through the middle here? We're not really doing anything in there right now, so that's fine. What if we take these power wires and now drag it right about there bring it down straight i don't think we have to go down all the way no we don't and this is kind of where it's going to go hmm this might go this way as well so i think it would be smarter if we put a d junction in here and all we have to do that is going to be quite quite a large project and I don't think we're gonna have reach for construct all of that stuff in here now how stuff in here no you can be unpaused now don't think I, you have to be paused right yeah okay take these out carry on with the construction we've got a few not few just one arch in already I'd like to have more but it it's just problems with the reach that's okay we'll um, carry on with this some of the minor things and since it is pretty uh, pretty boring doing all this pyramid stuff in here, I'll just do it off camera. And we'll try and design a couple of other things in about this zone here. Because we are already making this area a bit more green, I guess we could also expand it left side a little bit for these trees as well. Maybe it's not really needed. Right, they've taken the carrots out so this road can be connected. You're not really doing the rest of them. Okay, well, that's fair. Uh, we got a few more houses as well, and the beaver population has increased to, wow, 70 already. I initially was thinking that we shall, if we get some more metal, of course, 
do like metal fencing around this place and area. But now, since we don't really have a lot of met metal to spare just yet, might leave it all to... Where are the decorations? Here we go. Lots of you. That's going to take a lot of logs, but we've got plenty, I believe. Oh. Actually, this might just work. So what I'll do is pause. Ah, oh dear. Okay. Let's try and pause. All of you. Construct the middle one. Maybe this one as well. And if this works, this might actually... Uh, it might look pretty cool. Now, that looks pretty uh, pale in here. Nothing really... So, trees and more trees. Just to give it a... Make it look a bit more lively. On this corner, probably do a few, few berries. Three times the speed. Let's get this done. So we're happy with this zone in here. Slightly different designs, it seems. That's pretty much how I want it to be. Not sure about what to do with the large warehouses, but, you know, it's fine. Once we get a few trees going as well, it's going to look nice and green. Happy days. Maybe we can do a few more in here. There's two different ones. Maybe some chestnut trees. And chuck a few, uh, few of those berries in there as well. Beautiful. Um, this corner, honestly, just have have it like that. That's fine. Carrots are out. Carrots are done. That's not carrots. That's potatoes. It's okay. You get what I mean. And we go back to the decorations. Extend the fence just a little bit. And now the question is, do we bring it in from here? That's what we struggled with before, didn't we? So plant cities take these ones out bring it in and all we have to do is choose what kind of trees we'll plop a few trees in here farm stations let's relocate you as well we'll give them a i don't want to make it feel and look claustrophobic so maybe we give them a bit more space in here yeah like so uh we are losing valuable land for the potatoes though so that's gonna have to be fixed now what i'd like to do here if we are gonna make bread now maybe bread is something that how much wheat do we have in this district right flour wheat flour is not too much actually just a little bit i thought we're gonna have a lot more more spare actually and lots of bread though, so that's fine. And potatoes as well. Okay. Are you guys done as well? Almost. We'll stick a few platforms. If you remember seeing our Iron Teeth playthrough, which was the, I guess, season 2 in a way. What I really like to or love to do there was putting those platforms right above all the pathways as well. So essentially what I did was the power wires go under the platforms and on top of platforms we'll have the roof bits in case we well i guess we do live in a in a very hot climate here because if we have those massive droughts i'm pretty sure the temperature is not very beaver friendly either so i'm not sure if we do we have enough planks no we don't but build as much as you want and can these trees are in fantastic okay what else is there to do now because the water pumps are there and i don't think we have problems with the water in this district just yet uh, it would actually also be smart to have a few collection points yep we can do let's do a couple in here but what would be would be nice and smart is if we could build a few of those water barrel collection storages units all these words somewhere about here or maybe even closer maybe do you know what a uh, large water tank well this one might work actually and it might work pretty well yep let's do it this way uh, right behind the temple we've got a bit of a water tower and because this area is a bit more high rise anyways that water water tank fits here pretty nicely moving on let's check on the pyramid not much has changed has it they are not constructing any of those what about our castle build here 
How are we doing? Oh. Oh. Now we have to sort of wait for the metal platform to be completed. Ah, oh, silly me. I mean, it's just logs, right? I can still do it. Yep, there we go. Build as much as you can, beavers. And with the rest of it, you don't have hmm, explosives, which we will have to then, I guess, export. And that's okay. That's not a problem. Let's just send as much as water, as much water as we can down there. Bit of water management, really. You can be detonated. I hope there was no beavers in there. Nope. Okay, so that's fine. Same in here. And what we can do now, we'll just put another set of stairs that goes straight down. We'll have to drop you a few levels as well when maybe when there's an extra route. For now, everything seems to be good. But okay. Uh, now with the amusement, I'm gonna do a little bit of uh, thinking off camera. If I can't really think of a reason why we shouldn't have it here, then in the next uh, episode we shall most definitely have a carousel that's working in uh, in here and with maybe a small garden just to fill this space and the rest of it turn it into a forest and then we're kind of done I suppose. I think I do want to get rid of those carrots, turn this into a big potato farm instead but I also do not know where else should be placed those carrots. I don't want to take them too far, maybe this could have been perfect area in here, maybe. We'll live and see. I'm gonna take a little bit of time just to fix up a few things off camera, put down maybe a few more blueprints and see how we can get the rest of the pyramid done as well. It's just been, it's been taking quite a, quite a long time already and uh, I know you all want to see the end result so let me try and figure out ways how we can speed that process up a little bit. Anyways, that's gonna be the end of this episode so thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one.